in this video we will apply VLOOKUP function with trim function and we will see some magical things for example I want to find the price of the laptop from this table so I will type here VLOOKUP function equal VLOOKUP the lookup value is laptop so I have selected this comma this is our table array from we want to find the value again comma and the price is in the fourth column always remember that for we look up we count the columns from left to right so one two three and four therefore we will type here four comma and here we will put zero for the exact match if you want to know more about the we lookup and actual lookup functions then click here in the suggested video and watch the video now we will just press enter here you can see that instead of giving the price it is giving us a message that this value is not available what is the problem here there is a problem of the insertion point when i will click here here you can see that the insertion point is away from the word p there is a space so i will remove this space enter and the price will be shown there was a mistake with one word laptop and i found it solve it and then our vlookup function worked but what if you have a large table and you have this mistake at different points of course it will be very difficult to find these mistakes and remove these blanks so there is no need to find these mistakes there is a trim function that will be used with vlookup and these spaces will be recognize as the blanks and your VLOOKUP function will work accurately let's see that how for example here we have a space in this word mobile we will type here lookup formula equal VLOOKUP now instead of putting here the lookup value we will put here trim trim this is the trim function and the lookup value is this so the lookup value now is in the trim function now press comma and we will select the table array this is our table array again comma now the column index because we want the price so price is in fourth column so we'll type here four for the exact match we will type here zero close the bracket and press here you can see that instead of having blanks with this word the VLOOKUP function have worked accurately it is because we have used the trim function with the VLOOKUP function Similarly, these mistakes can be here in this table. For example, if there are three spaces, here you can see that if there will be any mistake in the table, then VLOOKUP function will also not work. So now we have to use the trim function with table array. So let's remove the table array. Type here trim, close the bracket, select the table array close the bracket and press enter now you can see the value so we use the trim function with vlookup function to remove the spaces and stay away from the errors in excel if you like the video please subscribe our youtube channel and don't forget to press the bell icon that's all for this video